Well, I, as a matter of fact, or a matter of utopy, all religions that I know preach, freedom, preach uh, peace, brotherhood, freedom, whatever. However, unfortunately, f a religion should be blamed for most of the misery and bloodshed in human history. And that's actually the painful reality. Therefore, I, I regard a, uh, a, an association like this association, the IDLR of great importance, bringing together people from all religions, from academy, from the clergy, and whatever, and advocating free, uh, religious uh, liberty. Well, as I said, it should be a natural thing. Unfortunately, it's not so natural. And freedom of religion, I mean, the thing is, we speak about religious tolerance. We should tolerate each other. I don't like the, the word tolerance. You tolerate something that is inferior. When you speak about you tolerate somebody, it means that you are superior. And the thing is, we are not superior and, you are, and the others are not inferior. We just don't know. Religion is a matter of belief. It's not a matter of science. If we knew we, which is the true religion, if there is such a thing, then all of us would adhere to that religion only, but then that would be the end of religion. That would be science. Science is about facts. Religion is about belief. And just like we expect the others to honor and respect our belief, the same way we should respect and honor their beliefs as much as we respect our own. By respecting the others' beliefs and religion, we, we actually respect our own religion. And that, that, this should be the core of the relations between or among religions. Well, first of all, religion is a, a reality, and it's important. It has its importance. Religion teaches us to be better people. And religion, if we are true, true adherents to the religion, we, we must be better people, because all the religions teach us to behave nice to each other, and whether our comrades from our religion or otherwise. Now, this, this should be a goal of religious leaders, of course, of politicians, and of academy. And that's, I think, the m meeting point where we all can meet and work for a better society. Well, usually we speak about freedom of belief, but there, there can't be any limit from belief. You can believe whatever you want, it's in your heart. Expression is something outside, you hear it. Now, it's important to have the freedom of expression of the different religions and within the religion. There should be boundaries because you can't, you can't unlike belief, which is unlimited. You believe whatever you want to believe and you, it hurts nobody. Expression can hurt, but we should be very careful where we draw the line because we tend naturally to regard as expression, which is not my expression or not my view, as dangerous. And so we should, we should abstain from doing that. On the other hand, we should know there is a limit. Expression hurts. Expression can hurt sometimes more than weapons. So we should be, there should be freedom of expression, which is part of freedom of religion, but not only freedom of religion. It's freedom of the human being. If you are religious or not, you want the freedom of expression. But we live within society and we should make sure that we don't hurt the others by our expression. Again, don't be, don't be too limited, don't be afraid of expression, but don't, don't push it to the, to the point where other people can be really hurt. Well, I participated, this is the third AIDLR conference that I participated in. Mm -hmm. On top of that, we had a, a uh, conference in Israel 
of my institute, the Paris Academic Center and the IADRN in IRLA. This by far was the best one that I attended. It was excellent arranged. Credit to Paolo and uh, to Brito. And, uh, and the, the, the people that, the, that he chose, I think there was an excellent variety of people coming from different sects, but all of them uh, were very good. I think it's really, it's a good, we set a, a standard that will be very hard, but we'll have to meet it in the next conference, because it really went up high.